if you are if you are launching a like a spacecraft to a planet which is 2000 light years away from earth how would be the budget and how much time it takes to build that aircraft life in spacecraft yes now time to reach or it will sustain in the orbit i mean time to reach 2000 light years 19 light years light years yes ah. See, one light year is, normally light travels uh, 3 lakh kilometers per second. So, in a minute, 3 lakh into 60, that many kilometers it will travel. In an hour, into 60, into 24 per day, into 365 per year. So, that is the... Uh, a distance. That means, if you travel at the speed of light, it will take one year. So, uh, uh, 2000 light years before, there is an interesting finding. Uh, some of the celestial bodies, they are not existing, but we can see them. Some of the stars like Rohini, Katai, Anybody born in the stars, that star is not there now. But we can see. As he told, you know, it may be 200 years or 100 years, light year away. Uh, the light energy started from them so many years back, only now coming. Physically, that object is not there. That is the finding with the telescope. That is the light years. Astronomical uh, distance is in a light years means uh, the, the distance travelled by light in one year. That is called one light year. Anyway, 2000 light years means in a, we don't know, it will be beyond our visibility. Okay. Miss May, this star where you born in. You know, my birth star is Rohini, the one Dr. Venkatama talked about? Exactly. He came up with an interesting piece of information on stars like Rohini and Ketai. Quoting recent findings, he says, these stars, Rohini and Ketai, they do not exist, but they can be seen by the naked eye. Oh. That's quite interesting and also we talked about light years when Nitesh of grade 10, he popped up this question on light years and the sir kind of explained, he gave a calculation and it was quite uh, interesting at the same time I was able to understand it. It was a clear description he gave. Yeah, he threw a lot of clarity on that and he gave the breakup of this calculation. That was really interesting. Yeah, as an English teacher, I myself understood that calculation as surprised. Of course, me too. <laughs> Now that viewers have known about life in Mars, light years, cryogenic engines, propulsions and propellants, they will also get to know about Gaganya in the next episode. Gaganya? What's that in this main way? That's a human space flight to low Earth orbit. ISRO has planned for sending a human space flight. Excellent. So we'll catch you in the next episode. Stay tuned.